Okay, everybody, I am with Professor Jesse Richardson. Jesse, you're gonna teach us one move, just one that we can have in a little handbag of tricks to defend ourselves on the okay. street. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Uh, so basically, the, the move is basically uh, anything that com comes from the center line. So it can be a multiple different uh, attacks, but it's anything coming from the center line in order to close the door to be able to defend yourself to either get away or put somebody in a submission. Okay, so my goal here is I'm the attacker. Yes. I'm gonna go for your hair. You're gonna close that door. Yes. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, 100%. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm stronger than I look, okay. <laughs> So whenever something comes to you, you're building a bridge. So this is the bridge. So instead of you coming across it, I want to use it to my advantage. I'm going to close the door. So I move away, closing the door to take away all of that other stuff. I look to a joint. This one would be the elbow to manipulate the elbow in the direction it doesn't go. And then the next joint would be the wrist. So I would break your arm here first, and then I would break your wrist. And then I wouldn't have to worry about that arm anymore. That was amazing. I totally <laughs> felt that pain. Okay, so uh, we're going to reverse roles where you're going to teach myself and then everybody watching how we can get this move down. Okay, sure. Okay. So just into more detail to explain what you're doing. When anything's coming from the center line, I always want you to close the door. So by that, I mean your arm should go this way. That way I don't have to worry about everything else on that side. Okay. So when you're reaching to grab my hair or grab my throat or anything on the center line, I'm controlling the bridge. And as I turn, I make sure I close the door. So what I want to do is what the jujitsu does is it's manipulating the joints. So your elbow naturally turns that way. I want it to go the other way. It doesn't turn. And you see exactly what you do. You go to the floor yeah. to take the pressure off. So by trapping your arm tight at the fulcrum and putting pressure, that's causing you to go to the floor where I'm manipulating your joint. And then my second option is to go here and there's the second joint that I have visible and there's the wrist manipulation to break your wrist. Okay. So once I take care of that arm, even if you know, you still be aggressive. I don't have to worry about anything coming from that side. Okay, so now you're gonna come to me. Yeah. But you're gonna walk me through it the same way. The yeah, first. Okay. 100%. Yeah. So I need to brush, I'm gonna go grab your hair. Okay. As soon as I do that, I build the bridge. No, both hands, grab with your, both hands. Good. Keep it tight now because now you control my arm. I don't control anything else. Okay. So you wanna close the door. So you're gonna step back with your right leg. That's it. Elbow comes over the top, set up for the fulcrum. That don't keep your posture. Okay. Keep your posture. Pinch this tight and now lift my wrist up to your, yeah, tap, good. And now go to the wrist. So slide your hand to my hand. Yeah, and now pull, pull my hand, to, pull my fingers towards my forearm. Yeah, more, no, just, yeah, yeah, more, more, tap, good. That's it. Okay, and then you, did you feel that gravity going to the ground? Yeah, because of the pressure that you're putting on my arm, my arm doesn't bend that way. So my natural reaction is going to be to go to the floor. And okay, because I certainly do. felt that as yeah. well. Thank yeah. you for this lesson, Professor Jesse.